Hi, this is Robin Moses and I am going to do a sprig design and what I'm doing is I'm starting off with a, a oh gosh, what is this color? Just a beautiful green. Like, um, what color is this? It's like limey. Limey! There we go, thank you. So, so I'm starting off with a lime green, okay? Now I'm taking this lime green across the nail and do you see where I started with the purple right there? This design is going to go from one to the other. It's going to shift designs. And I am going to do that like this. Okay? So, do you see how I did that? I did lime, then it went to purple, then I'm going to go to yellow. Okay? So I'm going to take yellow, I'm going to take my purple right here. Yellow, yellow half, and then these two are going to be pink. So it's just going to be um, slid into four different colors. Inside of the green I'm doing just white little baby daisies. So with the white I'm just going to go boom, 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 boom. Okay? They're just going to be kind of easy, kind of simple. Now, now if any of them get out of control and they look kind of goofy, I'm just going to fix them later. But the, I want them kind of close to this, okay? So that they look, so they look fun. Now I'm going to carry this design all through the green, and then when I hit purple, I'm going to change designs, and with my striper, is that, I hate this striper. Why do I keep it? I forgot. <laughs> Never mind about that. Hold on. I'm getting my good striper, and it's not clean. So I'm cleaning my striper. Now with um, the purple, Okay, I'm starting in with this purple, and with another purple, a lighter purple, I'm going to stripe in right here where they meet. Okay, and then I'm going to go in, and it's just going to be purple with light purple stripes across all the purple. Okay, so this one is just going to have purple stripes going across like this. Now see that first striping brush that I picked would have taken forever to get these stripes on like this, especially as perfect as these. So I'm just going to finish off all the purple ones like this. Okay? So I've added white with my pink and through the center here I'm going to add my pink stripe. Do you see that it's still kind of translucent? You can kind of see through it. I should add more white, but I'm going to go back over it one more time. Kind of go in there, stripe it in, boom, okay. And then I'm going to just do a randomized stripe through here of all the colors I'm using. So I'm going to go in with the pinks, like this. And you see how, do you see how translucent that is? That's going to need another coat. So then I'm going to do with the green that I went over um, with the daisies. And I'm going to go through that with green. Then I'm going to go through with that purple color and just do purple next up to the green. Okay. And then maybe another purple that's darker right here. Okay. And I'm basically just going to build up a whole bunch of multicolors right there. And then my last pink, I'm going to stop right here with another pink, right, another pink stripe right here. Boom and then finish that off like this and then with that same uh, bright pink color I'm going to take my, um, I'm going to go back to using my pink brush and then I'm going to put in polka dots okay, you think of a line, boom, like this go down in a straight line across the side of the nail like this okay, then on either side you hit both sides to make a square. See how it goes into a square? Then you go like this. Like that. In between, in between, in between, in between, in between. Then in between, in between, in between. And it will start to take on the perfect, perfectly in place of polka dots. 
Okay, I have all of the, um, the, the stripes in here. So what I'm gonna go is I'm gonna go through the stripes with filigree. And the filigree is gonna go straight up against the pink line like this. And you know, a lot of people might say, oh, this is so hard and everything, but really it's just steps. And when you see them all together and I put all these nails together, you'll see what I mean. It's just step by step by step. So I'm just filigreeing in over the stripes so that it doesn't look too stripy. And you'll see what I mean. But the white really will punch it out and kind of cover it up. And that's why I didn't have to do the stripes on this too perfectly. There's that. Okay, so there's so there's the filigree on these two. Boom. Okay. Now I'm going to carry this over here and then just do a little tiny bit in here. But it kind of just separates the two designs between one uh, the purple lines and this line, blah la la. Okay, now let me back up so you can see. Oh my god, I did it the right way. I usually do it the wrong way every time. Okay. Here is the design going from one right to the other, okay? Now I'm going to go in with foil glue and I'm just going to hit all of them with um, different colors of glitters. Okay, and on this one I am just going to do black, a black circle here, okay? And then I'm going to do another black circle here, like this. And then there's going to be two little lines like boom and boom. And a line like this through the center. And I'm going to do a pink ladybug. Okay, with the best glue ever, I'm going in and I'm just going to top very, very lightly over the design like this. Okay, I've gone through these two just over the tops of the lines. I went through the, the filigree with um, the glue right here. Then with this one, I'm going again with the best glue ever around the whole the whole nail right here. Just a very, very fine veil of it. Okay, now um, with with um, dollarnailart.com opal glitter right there, the mylar foil, I'm just going over and I'm just touching over the top of it. This is going to just give extra shine to these nails and it's really not going to do anything other than make them look shiny and kind of like um, balloons, you know? And it's going to make them look really pretty. Like that, okay? You see how it gives them more dimension? All right. Then with um, Essence Glam Glitter Pink, it's a purple. And um, and I am just gonna, hold on, I need to get this brush clean. So, so with the Essence Glam by Enos, then I'm gonna go in and just kinda just tap it over the top of there a little bit. I don't want really thick amounts of glitter here on this nail. It's important to me. I want to keep these nails a little glittery, not very glittery. I want them to be enhanced by glitter, not defined. So this is just going to be tapped on. So tap, 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 like this. And then when I use my brush to take away the extras, it'll just be left just a little bit shimmery. Okay, now with the other hand, <laughs> now with the other hand, I'm going to take the um, the opal foil again where I had it before on my bug. Where's my bug? There we go. And see, I'm just going to loosen it on this one, make it look more shiny like this. And like that. Okay? And that just gives it just more just a more finished look, just makes it look more cool. Like, whoa, those are cool. But, it doesn't look like decals, okay? Then, um, last but not least, with, um, glam, uh, with MAC Reflex Gold Glitter, I'm going to go in and um, tap on through the filigree. Now, I picked Re Reflex Gold over here because with Reflex Gold, it's clear dink right here. It's clear, but you can see through where the filigree is, so I won't um, cover up all of my um, swirls. So I'm just going to tap in like this, and you'll still be able to see my swirls. Everything is really, really shiny and added, but it's not just glitter, okay? 
So there's that. And then I'm gonna wipe these and top coat. And I okay, and we are back. So really this is like four designs in one and you can pick out one if you like it and just do all of them like that. Let me scroll down. There are the little flowers and it goes off into the purple and then it goes and makes the purple over here. And let me go over, okay, and then there's the half purple and then it goes off into the filigree and the pink and then the little ladybug. And then I'm gonna scroll back so you guys can see that I took it from this little skirt to match and it's gonna look so cute. And um, I hope you guys like this. This was a lot of fun to do. It takes a lot of time to decide how you're going to do it, but once you do it, it is really worth it because she's gonna get a ton of comments on these, and especially these, this hand right here is just awesome. Anyways, I hope you guys liked it. There is way more to come. Please join, fan, subscribe, tell everybody, and practice and show me. Show me at Robin Moses Nail Art at Facebook. That's where I'm looking at all the nail art that you guys do. And you guys have a wonderful night, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.